I have lost my mind. Chickens are a downward spiral of horrendous times and hours of time sink. So, when we last left off, we were aiming for the lava chicken. And I went off camera to do that. <laughs> Since then, there have been some developments. <laughs> so, hear me out. It takes so long to breed these chickens <laughs> that I was like, let's triple it and try and breed more while we wait for others. We have so many chickens now, but there it gets worse. So I'm not just breeding to get the chickens, I'm then needing to breed them to be better. So you have to like breed them for their stats. So to get the stats, you breed two chickens together to get one with better stats. And as you can see, like for this one, for example, it has to get to 100%. And it's doing almost 0.1 every second. It has taken me so long to get here. I started this recording session on Saturday. I think I finished at 3. It's now Sunday at 12. And I'm not going to lie, I took a little break. But I, I was still going at 1 in the morning. Um, just trying to get to a point because what happened was so we did all the stuff to get to the lava chicken we did the nether quartz we did we did all of that and we got to lava great and we've got the eggs the problem with the eggs are it says it's like a one-off bucket and I was like cool so what I can do is I can come over to our tank and bam oh wait I can't uh, ooh, ooh, uh, okay. Um, yeah, it doesn't work like that. So you end up in a bit of a predicament. So then I was like, hey, why don't we try and find something that can place? Um, place the, the block, basically. There's no block placer that I can find that will right click this onto a tank and allow it to go in. And I think that's because of the egg itself acting a little strange. So what I can do, obviously, is I could always just do this and be like, oh, okay, cool. Well, we need to fill up our lava. So we just go one at a time. I could even do this into a tank. It's not gonna cause me like endless dismay sort of thing. Oh, 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 oh my God. Uh, did we lose that? We did lose that. I think it's fine. We have spare. Um, but yeah, I can I can do this and I can basically just kind of go back and forth and spend plenty of time doing this. But the point of this was to automate power so we didn't have this issue. Uh, and if I'm just going to every so often do this, the lava chicken isn't our solution. So then I had to go back to the drawing board and I had to say to myself, well, what is the solution for power then? Where it's something that maybe the chickens produce renewably because they produce so much of stuff. Like the bone meal chicken, this made this so much easier because we need so many seeds to keep this going. We built a new farm um, just to keep the seeds going because they use two seeds every time they breed and it's just so much. Um, let's swap some of these over so I don't waste their potential. Um, oh, and this is how you can see how much breeding I've done. All of these and all of these to get to basically this so far. This is how many chickens we've had to breed. We can cook these for cooked chicken as well. We have so much food here. It's insane. Um, 777 so he can replace him and this is literally what I've been doing off camera so I was like there's no point in doing this on camera for you guys this is nuts this is the most boring thing in the world but I've been doing it because what we came up with is that 
uh, we can use the pneumostatic dynamo with the lapidary calibration, right? And with this in place, we can burn emeralds for 200,000, uh, nether quartz for 40,000, or diamonds for 1.2 million RF, right? So then I said to myself, well, we need to get the diamond chicken then. And if we look at the diamond chicken, it can be bred with a glass chicken and a gold chicken. So I was like, okay, we need the gold chicken. How do we get the gold chicken? The gold chicken uh, comes from, sorry, one second. Oh, shit. I reset his progress. Uh, gold chicken, uh, so, wait, okay, yeah. Gold chicken comes from iron and yellow. Yellow chicken, you have to basically craft a yellow egg. Yellow egg is egg plus yellow dandelion. So at that point I needed lots of eggs. So then I made a smart chicken. A smart chicken is a chicken plus a book. So I had regular chickens as well, just in case. Okay, right, so that was just to get the yellow. <laughs> then we needed the iron chicken. The iron chicken is luckily the bone white, which we found as just a general thing, and the flint chicken. Perfect, we found those. That was easy. That was an easy step, to be fair. Then we needed the glass chicken, which was the redstone chicken and nether quartz chicken. We had the quartz chicken, so that was fine. The redstone chicken requires the sand chicken and the red chicken. The red chicken, again, requires us to make red eggs, throw the eggs, grow the chickens up, and then be able to use them. The sand chicken took so long to find again. It took so long, in fact, we found another Mjolnir. <laughs> we now have two hammers. Um, yeah, it took so long to get to that. But then, once we had these two, we bred these two together and we made the diamond chicken. Now we have the diamond chicken. What we're trying to do is when we're trying to make the stats 10, 10, 10, once the stats are 10, 10, 10, then we will get plenty of diamonds in and we can run our system off of this. This is the best power source I've found. Like I, I can run my entire operation here right now off of just this, just one of them. So what we'll do, we'll make a couple, we'll give them some upgrades and stuff, and then we should be looking pretty. I swapped our energy cell out because I was finding that it was bugging out sometimes and not accepting power. We still need to tidy this. I moved it all just because I needed space to work in off camera, um, but I've not really done much. I think I've made a couple more machines, but that's it. Because we needed, I made a watering can. <laughs> I made a better watering can to be able to uh, try and get wheat quicker until I found out about the bone meal chicken, uh, and then I was very happy. So, with that all being said, the only other thing I've done, I think, off camera is I made the advanced inscribers because I wanted to be able to process uh, stuff better, basically. Um, I needed more, more equipment, and this was much quicker. I made some acceleration cards to make them faster. And that was it, basically, because I was trying to knock out some little bits. So that was my yesterday. <laughs> so what we're going to do for now, I think, is we're going to leave this behind. Because I'll lose my mind if we keep working on this. And instead, as you saw me pick it up, we're going to work on the Alexa Britannia. Although, well, I did some caving. We're going to go open this. This is terrifying, because this could damage things, I think unsure but we're going to open this underground um it came out of a chance cube and we're just gonna we're just gonna let it do its thing for a second we have no food eek i don't know if this will spawn bad things it disappeared oh it dropped something a bag of holding Oh, cool. So just kind of like a, another storage bag. Okay. <laughs> that was terrifying and actually very rewarding in the end. Uh, going up the stairs, super easy now that we can fly as well. <laughs> Being Thor is a, a blessing. Um, one thing I have learnt is we can make MREs, which are a great source of food. They only stack in four and they produce dirty plates at the end, but... It's pretty, pretty solid. Um, I like the bag of holding, to be fair. It's kind of cute. Do I prefer it to this bag? Yeah, I do. 
The UI is nicer looking. It's cleaner. So let's just chuck those things in here. And then we chuck the bag away for now. When we when we plan to move, having two bags will be great because we can probably ram this entire base into two bags and then move whatever we need to move. Uh, this one to here. Oh my god. Uh, oh, we've got a 9, 10, 9 and a 10, 8, 9. Perfect. Perfect. Okay, right. We've almost filled two diamond chests. We haven't even started on the emerald ones. We don't need the emerald ones as much, um, but they are one step after the diamond. So I was like, we may as well just, just for the sake of it. Um, but these produce so many resources. Like, I think realistically, if we can, we might try and just base ourselves completely out of chickens. Because I think you can make most things out of chickens. Uh, the only thing that sucks is this. Gold nuggets versus, like, the iron chicken, which actually drops iron. But otherwise, everything else is solid. I mean, we've got so much quartz now. Remember when we were really struggling with quartz? Thing of the past. I'm actually, to be fair, currently smelting loads down just to make tons of silicon so that we can do more AE stuff later. God damn. This is halfway through the episode, just me catching you guys up. Um, but let's let's blitz into this then. So we want a flower pouch. So we need wool. That's fine. We can make some wool. Let's make some wool. We should have some flowers on us, which are fine. Let's just do that for a second. Because the flower pouch allows us to hold all of the flowers, which is perfect. Now what we need to go and do is we basically... There's no point in progressing into the mod until we've gone and just bashed a load of flowers. Um, so let's fly over somewhere. This power is beyond great. Uh, I also keep finding these little slime eggs. I don't know if they produce slimes or what, but it gives us slime balls. And I'm never going to say no to that. Um, okay. So we're just looking for flowers currently. Also, one thing I did need to note, so there's this extra tab which explains the God of Thunder stuff. So actually because of this, we get extra health, extra fall resistance, jump boost, and resistance, and sprint speed, and sprint speed strength, and then all the powers that come along with it. Even tough lungs, I don't know what it does, makes you able to breathe in space. So <laughs> if we go into Galacticraft, we don't even need to worry anymore. It's nuts. It's actually nuts that we found one, let alone two. Um, so, pretty crazy. Uh, so, we're, we're pretty set now in terms of just living our lives, really. We've got so much health, like 50 health you can see in the corner. Uh, we've got loads of armor. Like, even if I take my armor off, we still have, residually, half a bar of armor, which is a bit nuts. Um, so, yeah, pretty happy. <laughs> We are literally a god, um, and I know this. the the mod that introduces that has so many other um, superhero stuff. There's like Ant-Man stuff in this and everything. There's a Batania flower, and they go straight into the bag of flowers, which is good. Uh, so we're basically just kind of running around looking for Batania flowers. Uh, the only thing that seems to be bad about flying is the fact that it causes me to fly into danger far more often. <laughs> Like, I've, I've flown into dragons a fair bit of time now. Uh, they they do just kill. They don't care what's going on in the slightest. Just burn me to death. Okay, right. Exploring. Is that a Batania flower? No, it's just a blue orchid, though. Die. Uh, I have been killing a lot of cows as well, because we need the beef for the MREs. Um, and you will see the MRE is such a good food source. Look at this. Full saturation, full food from just one, like, munch. It's pretty great. Uh, and we only need, like, beef. Um, what is it? Beef, uh, potatoes, carrots. Uh, literally, like, that is it. Uh, we need some iron, but we've got infinite iron now, so... We don't even need to worry about the fact that we could waste that iron if need be. It's not going to change our lives a huge amount. Uh, more Batania flowers. They're kind of very vibrant looking. You can kind of spot them quite easily. Um, and the nice thing is about the bag is it'll tell me when I've got all of them. Because I can look and I can go, well, I'm missing tons still. 
Obviously, I, I knew that, don't worry. I wasn't, I wasn't going like, oh, I can't believe I'm still missing loads. I knew that I was missing loads. Uh, we could have, we should have bought some shears with us, to be fair, but it's not the end of the world, because we could have picked up that big plant and been like, aha, big plant, but alas, no. Uh, keep on looking. Keep on, oh, hello. Dead, dead. We, we literally one hit things now because I fully upgraded the sword as well. I think, I think did I do that on camera? I don't know. Because we get so much um, quartz in, it wasn't even a worry for me. I just literally just slapped a load of quartz on and it was done. Uh, oh, red. Here we go. Red. What colours are we missing now? Still a lot, I know, but... Orange, light blue, yellow, green. Some of the darker colours, mostly. Let's take off. Hey, yeah, yeah. Uh, okay. It's a. Uh, it's hard to find these, to be fair, in this like little area. Oh, I've just realised. Uh, one second. My audio isn't coming out of my headset, and I know why now. Which means you guys probably haven't had any audio. Um, my bad. This is like most of that you didn't need audio for. There we go. You've got audio now. I've got audio now. I was like, what's happening? I can hear things, but not properly. Oh my god. Ow. Ow. What the hell? What were you? Why were you so strong? Uh, what is this? Uh, more white flowers. I mean, the white flowers are pretty good. Uh, because they're how you make some of the, like, pure daisies at the start. Oh, a brown flower. Perfect. We only need one of every flower as well. And then we can bone meal to get more. Which is fine. Uh... Boing! I'm so sorry about the audio. That's actually so bad of me. Because it's only because I launch the game a lot of the time without my headphones on. And then I forget. And then I have to basically refresh the audio in my ears. For it to come through. Ooh, pure white cow. Um, what are we looking for? What are we looking for? Are these. Oh, yes, yellow flowers. Perfect. That was one win missing. Hello. Goodbye. It's great to be able to one hit creepers. They're probably the scariest mob in terms of just like, blam, you're dead. So it's nice to be able to uh, just deal with that quickly. Uh, just flower picking, it's lovely. Very relaxing. Uh, pink. I think we've got pink already, though. Death. Dead. <laughs> it's weird, like, I know I'm definitely strong now in this game, but I know there are things that are going to kill me still. Like the dragons. Uh, still not strong enough to, one, defend from a dragon. Ooh. We run around a bit too fast. We crashed. No, we're good. We're good. Um, yeah, I'm not strong enough to defend from a dragon or survive a dragon yet. Uh, or kill a dragon, sorry. Defend and survive, same thing. Those wizards are a little bit annoying. Brown. Aha. Okay. Brown is good. Lovely. Let's grab as many of these as possible. While I said, obviously, I, I only need one, it's still better to grab more. So what are we missing now? Black, purple, cyan, light grey, grey, green, blue, orange. Still a fair few. I literally hate hearing the chickens in the background now. I spent so long just listening for, listening out for chickens while I was hunting them. That now, like, hearing them in the background is a little bit of a mind-numbing killer for me. Um, but this, the, the run speed is beyond glorious. The fact that we can sprint around and give, get this jump boost as well. We're literally just cruising. Cruising around at the speed of sound. -na 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 -na. Don't know what song that is. I made it up, and it's a number one hit. Hup. Get me out of the water. Get a little... You get pulled off by your hammer? Ew. <laughs> oh, God. 
I don't want this to be another I go away and start hunting for flowers. Please. Please show me show me the flowers that I need. Is this one that I needed? I don't remember. We got it now though. Uh, it's not one that we needed. Damn it. Right. Um, it's very hard to control though. That is one thing I will say. It's very hard to control because you have to just, you're constantly pointing in the direction Ooh, you want to go. Um, I don't think it breaks though, which is nice. So I've got two, but it's like, I didn't need two. I only needed one really. Okay. We're not dragging any behind. Where are we on the map? I don't even know. Where are we on the map? Find me. Follow. Aha! Here. We go across to here, maybe? And away we go! Oh, is that? No. And away we go! It's easier if you get some, like, yeah, some flat terrain, like over here. You can kind of see things a little bit clearer. Mm, he says flat terrain as it becomes immediately mountainous. I have learned though, if I slam into someone, it does damage. Like that. Very cool. Key! Uh, ooh, another... Another applied... Uh, thing. Ooh! A pirate ship! This feels like a Thor thing. I can press X and I can become supercharged. Welcome to the land of the dinosaur and a midnight star. No, abilities on cooldown. I mean, it's just yeah. It's cool and all, but. It's not the most helpful thing. Oh my god, hello. Hello? 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 Christ. That was a that was a lot. Um not even for much good stuff, right? Uh chuck all of this away. Do I hear like a parrot? Not, not seeing greatness here. I do hear a parrot though, for sure. I just don't know where. Parrot? Parrot? Why are we climbing? No parrot up here. I don't know. We take no full damage as far as I'm aware now, which is great as well. Don't know. Um, that was a little bit of a detour on our um, flower finding mission. Okay, ooh, this one I think is one we need, right? second. I think that's one that we didn't have. Yes, okay, cool. We need to repair our sword as well, I'm seeing. I'm seeing it a little bit damaged. Uh, grass over here. Nothing. Ooh, orange. Do we have orange yet? No, perfect. Lovely. Look at that. We got one orange at least. That's all we needed. As I say. One orange. Uh, so we're now looking for mostly like the black and the grey, right? Okay. What's this? Oh. Uh, Nothing seems to spawn underground, by the way, in terms of chickens. If anyone's ever wondering, like, oh, how do you find all the chickens? 
it is just kind of above ground. It's not spec uh, specific. Like I was looking for the sand chickens, so I went to find a, a desert biome. It's not. It doesn't work like that. They are literally just. If it says it spawns in the overworld, it could be anywhere, which is a little annoying. If it was at least kind of somewhat location based, it would have been a lot easier. Um, but you know, you live. We could probably make um. We could probably make floral fertilizer as well to find the ones we can't find, actually. Yeah, we've got all of those ingredients in bulk. So where are we at then? Uh, we've got almost everything except one, two, three, four, five. I thought we picked up orange. Oh, we did. It just didn't go in. Okay. One, two, three, four is what we're missing then. Well, let's quickly run across to the other island. If we don't see anything over here, we will go back home and we'll make tons of floral fertilizer and just literally finish this in a second because I don't even know why we left our home. See, these are sand chickens. Ridiculous. Took so long to find. Uh... Mm. <laughs> uh, blue and purple at least. Let's grab these. There's a wizard here that needs to die. They've become my enemy. Yes, dead wizards are good wizards. And they have coolish looking loot. I don't fully understand, but it's cool. Um, don't know what still creates those explosions. Um, no, okay, so that's fine. Let's teleport home. Let's dump our stuff that we found. So let's just dump all of this away for a second. And then in here, we also want to just get rid of these bits. We'll open the bags real quick. Um, that's a bag. There we go. And then we want these. And let's open these. Uh, engraved thunder. Unsure. Some cool, useless stuff. Cool. Some also useless stuff, I think. Corrupted chorus fruit. Ooh. Nether steel? Okay. Uh, let's chuck all of this away. Okay, so what we'll do. Uh, I want those MREs. Uh, give me my food. Okay. What we'll do then is we will make a load of red a load of yellow and a load of bone meal. It's that easy. We can just come over here just for the sake of it. We'll chuck it in the system to make it easier. And then bang. Four stacks. And then all you do with this is you need some a little grassy area. Like say, I don't know, like up here. And then you take your floral fertilizer and you just hit it on the ground. And it will spawn all sorts of flowers, and then you just break them. Nice and simple. And to be fair, we don't even need the bloody bone meal to make loads of flowers. We probably get plenty from just doing this. I mean, I think that's most of our collection done. Actually, that's all of our collection done. <laughs> I don't even know why we spent the time exploring. Uh, quite simply, this was the best and quickest way with the fact that we have hundreds of resources. Uh, crazy. Okay, well what I'm going to do is I'm going to farm the rest of this floral fertilizer quickly, and then we'll come back and we'll get into Britannia. Sounds good. See you in the next one. Oh wow, you've actually made it this far. Okay, um, three things. Um, don't forget to maybe watch another video, I don't know which side I'm on. These ones, this or this, there's a box with a video. Um, consider subscribing and maybe like the video. Leave a comment, I'll, I'll say hello. Anything. Go, go wild.